Hi there, I'm John from CNCRI.com and today we're going to do some CNC routering inside of custom black walnut charcuterie boards. Now, just to give you an idea of what we're doing, uh, this is black walnut, it's live edge, and we're actually etching in different things into the board itself. It's roughly a quarter inch or six millimeters deep. And it's actually done with the little machine behind me here, which is, it, which is our ShopBot desktop, which I've had almost 10 years, I think, right now. And it's a wonderful machine, still works great to this day. And for this one here, it's a maple leaf. And I'm also doing another one with a larger security board. And this one here has a four leaf clover. Now you've seen me do a lot of custom laser work in the shop here doing this kind of stuff and you might be wondering why would I use our CNC router, even our small CNC router instead of our large CNC router and why would I use that over let's say a laser? Uh, the most direct answer to that is control. With our laser there's no two-way feedback system meaning that I can't say go a quarter inch deep and the laser will go a quarter inch deep. The laser will just engrave and that's basically what you get. Now you can pass over it many 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 times and that's how you get your depth inside of especially wood but again there's no two-way feedback system so if you notice here you have darker wood and lighter wood and that has different densities so what you'd end up with is an engraving that's not even and with a flat surface as you see at the bottom here might be why don't I use my full sheet CNC router to do these jobs instead of my little ShopBot desktop. Uh, both machines are totally amazing and they would do a great job but they're very specialized in the way that they work. The little one here does an amazing job on small engraving because the gantry which is this part over here is so small so there's almost zero flex in the gantry depending on what material I'm doing of course so with wood there's no movement. It's a lot quicker setup as well and I also have t-slots on here. Now that's something I'll be integrating into my full sheet machine later on, but the full sheet machine is used for larger projects where uh, using T-squares and that kind of stuff just aren't really useful for it. I can just screw things directly into, into the table itself. Just show you the 40 leaf clover a little bit closer so you can see what happens. Now there's a little bit of, of extra wood here that's not a problem and the reason we're doing this actually is for a customer and what they're going to do is actually pour some resin into it so it'll be a nice solid even surface with whatever we uh, engrave into the wood 
that's what you sort of see using different colors and that kind of stuff. So it's a pretty neat application uh, for security boards. And of course, we can mix and match different machines. So we can have whatever you want etched into the, uh, in the security boards in this case here, but we can also go onto the laser to do more customized things. Now the advantage to the laser is that it can have very sharp, precise uh, engraving and contrast created on the board, which I can't really do with a CNC router because I'm generally limited to an eighth of an inch or three millimeter diameter bit. With a laser, it's the thickness of your hair, so it's infinitely more higher resolution than you can with a router. So again, there's no perfect machine out there. There's just the best one given the application. So if you're looking for custom uh, security boards or engraving into them or what have you, contact me at cncri.com. We'll do the work and ship it right to your door. <laughs>